In a remarkable find that has captured the attention of scientists and the public alike, the remains of a 50,000-year-old baby mammoth named Yana have been unearthed in Siberia. The discovery was made in the remote Yakutia region, specifically in the Batagaika Crater, the world's largest permafrost crater. Yana's remains, preserved almost perfectly by the region's harsh cold, offer an extraordinary glimpse into a world that existed tens of thousands of years ago. Yana, named after the nearby Yana River Basin, is considered the best-preserved mammoth carcass ever discovered. Her remains were found during the summer of 2024 by local residents who stumbled upon her as they traversed the thawing permafrost. According to Maxim Cherpasov, the head of the Lazarev Mammoth Museum Laboratory, the discovery was serendipitous. The residents were in the right place at the right time, Cherpasov explained. They saw that the mammoth had almost completely thawed out and decided to construct a makeshift stretcher to lift her to the surface. Yana's preservation is astonishing. Despite some parts, like the forelimbs, being eaten by predators or scavenging birds, her head remains remarkably intact. This preservation is critical, as it allows scientists to study her physical features, such as her trunk and facial structure, in extraordinary detail. Weighing over 100 kilograms, 15 stone, 10 pounds, and measuring 120 centimeters, 4 feet tall, and 200 centimeters, 6.5 feet long, Yana was estimated to be only about one year old when she died. Her small size suggests that she was still heavily reliant on her mother when she met her untimely demise. Gavril Novgorodov, a researcher at the Lazarev Mammoth Museum Laboratory, hypothesized that Yana likely became trapped in a swamp. The swamp environment may have been what preserved her for tens of thousands of years, Novgorodov noted. Yana's discovery is one of only seven similar mammoth finds in the world. Five of these have been in Russia, and one was uncovered in Canada. Each discovery adds a piece to the puzzle of understanding life during the Ice Age. The Batagaika Crater, where Yana was found, is an immense depression in Siberia caused by melting permafrost. Known colloquially as the gateway to the underworld, it has become a hotspot for paleontological discoveries. The thawing ground, a direct consequence of climate change, is revealing secrets long hidden in the frozen earth. However, while the crater offers a unique opportunity for scientific discovery, it also serves as a stark reminder of the effects of global warming. The melting permafrost releases trapped greenhouse gases, exacerbating the very issue causing its thaw. Yana's carcass is now housed at the Northeastern Federal University in Yakutskatsk, the capital of the Yakutia region. There, scientists are conducting a series of tests to determine the precise timeline of her existence. These studies will include radiocarbon dating, isotopic analysis, and genetic sequencing. Such analyses provide invaluable insights into the life and environment of mammoths. By examining isotopes in Yana's tusks, researchers can infer details about her diet, migration patterns, and even the seasons of her life. Additionally, genetic studies may offer clues about her species population genetics, health, and eventual extinction. Yana is not the only prehistoric creature to have emerged from Siberia's thawing permafrost in recent years. In November 2024, researchers unveiled the mummified remains of a saber-toothed cat, estimated to be 32,000 years old. Earlier in the year, the carcass of a 44,000-year-old Ice Age wolf was also uncovered in the region. These finds, while scientifically invaluable, raise concerns about the broader implications of permafrost melt. Long dormant pathogens, greenhouse gases, and environmental disruptions could have profound consequences as the frozen ground continues to thaw. Yana's discovery represents more than just a paleontological triumph. It is a window into the Ice Age, offering a tangible connection to a time when mammoths roamed the Earth alongside early humans. These creatures, now extinct, played a crucial role in their ecosystems, shaping landscapes and influencing vegetation. The study of Yana and similar finds allows scientists to reconstruct the environments of the Pleistocene epoch, shedding light on the challenges and adaptations of species that thrived in such extreme conditions. Furthermore, understanding the factors that led to the extinction of mammoths could provide critical lessons as modern species face the threat of climate change and habitat loss. The unveiling of Yana is a testament to the importance of collaboration between local communities and scientific institutions. The involvement of local residents in her discovery underscores the value of grassroots efforts in scientific exploration. Their quick thinking ensured that this rare find was preserved and brought to the attention of researchers. As Yana undergoes further study, she joins the ranks of other iconic mammoth discoveries, such as the Yucca Mammoth and the Luba Calf. 
Each of these finds contributes to a growing body of knowledge that enriches our understanding of Earth's history and the incredible creatures that once inhabited it. While Yana's story is rooted in the past, her discovery has implications for the future. The data gleaned from her remains will not only illuminate the Ice Age, but also inform conservation efforts, climate science, and our understanding of species survival. Yana is more than just a 50,000-year-old mammoth, she is a bridge between epochs, a reminder of the fragility and resilience of life. As scientists continue to unlock her secrets, she will undoubtedly inspire awe and curiosity for generations to come.